is Fatia Masa. I'm the executive director and the founder of the Grassroots Sisterhood Foundation, um, working in the northern, three northern parts of uh, Ghana. Um, I have about 75 grassroots women's groups and uh, organizations, um, leading about 6,000 women from the three northern regions of Ghana. In Ghana, we have dual um, ownership of land. Um, part of our land is about 80% is in the hands of traditional authority. And traditional authority are usually kings, chiefs, clan heads, or even family heads. And um, the other 80% is under the trust of government, which government uses for its development work. Women's rights on land are not that respected constitutionally and in the Declaration of Non-Discrimination, women are protected by some of these laws. But unfortunately, in actual practice, the reality on the ground is that women access land through the male uh, siblings uh, of their family, either male siblings or male relatives, husbands, fathers, uncles or grandparents or whatever. And, and so, no matter the status of the woman, if it is at the urban center, perhaps she could access and own her own land if she has resources to buy them. But at the rural community, women are less, are very, very disadvantaged because of the cultural uh, practices that are in there, that in most instances makes the woman the second class citizen in every household. Uh, the area of my work uh, is into land, ensuring that women access justice through the uh, facilitating community uh, watchdogs, training them, teaching them about the laws, land laws, women's rights generally, so that they can lead processes at community level and bring about change in their communities.